Hi, this is Townscaper. Uh, this game was made by one of the developers of Bad North, and I wanted to kind of pay tribute here uh, because they're the first people that ever gave the show a big retweet uh, when we played the show originally, and that got up to, I think, 50 views at the time. What's this idiot doing? <laughs> He's trying to hide from me, dude. <laughs> ah! Heavy? Yeah. <laughs> Why is it only big guys? <laughs> Dude, because the bigger they are, the better they hug. I guess so. You wanna come in there and snug up on your boy? Which was big, big news. We got a few subs out of it, so uh, I wanted to play this game. It looked really, really cool, and also castly and neat. Uh, so let me figure out how to do this first. Oh, oh, whoa! My goodness gravy, that is cool. Oh, neat. And if you're into like really cool, like, uh, atmosphere type games, I guess, this is a really neat one. Oh, this is my first time playing it. I have seen lots of people play this game. I would live there probably. It just seems really, really neat. And I wanted to get my hands on it, too. Nope. Change my mind. This is the new... Wait. Can I change colors? Nope. Well. This is my house. This is where I live. I'm a back castle keep, and this would be all one big set for the show. Is it curling? It's curving? Oh, cool. That's neat! Let's build a house for Bernie. There you go. One house for Bernie. A perfect house for a perfect boy. Ooh, that's like the uh, town center. This is just wonderful. This is a game I could probably see myself. That's how you do it. Right click to destroy. No, I want to leave the basement cellar there. Probably some cool witches live in there. Reading their poetry to each other, brewing some potions. No big deal. No big deal at all. Um... <laughs> of course, the place that I would pick would be an eyesore to the entire town. I think it'd be kind of neat to have a place like this. Like a little tiny house commune. It has its own currency, has its own kind of government. And everything's real cheap, but nice looking. Like, no one would have to, like, pay that much. So, like, your only real job would be to keep it real nice and clean like this. And real, just, beautifully aesthetic. Unlike everything you ever touched or created. And everyone would meet in the morning for town center uh, meetings every morning. Kind of like a cult, really. I want a nice, aesthetically pleasing cult. With poetry witches. And musicians. And artists. And other internet weirdos like myself. That's what I want. Then you gotta build the lakeside townhouses here. Actually, no, this is the. No! No! That's not what I want! Hey, here we go. A nice tower. Good. Nice tower here in the middle. I said, I said nice tower here in the middle. There we go. I say, you know, the bells up here, the rings, and everybody comes out of their house like, <sighs> Captain Mayor wants us to meet in the middle of town square for his boring meetings. Do I want to have windows that lead to the ocean that I could fall out of? Yeah, probably. Every once in a while, someone's going to bust out and fall straight down to the middle. I should probably change color. Uh, blue is a worthless trash color, so let's go with purple. I want to live at town with what, what like, aesthetic. <laughs> a real professional storyteller. All I want is a pleasingly aesthetic cult, town center, where everyone can get together and do their seances just like everybody else. But I'm a man who likes technicolored vomit. I like technicolored vomit on a muted colored background. 
as you can probably see here. Just, I want to make everything as ugly as me. Now that's a town. Now it is that's a place for someone to live. Yes. Gorgeous, even. This looks like a good place for another tower. This is the dungeon if you don't clean up your room in time. This is the witch tower. Beautiful. Now this... This is a beautiful, perfect town. Nothing wrong with this. Oh, I need to build like a school or something. What color are schools? Schools have colors? Uh, actually, aren't they yellow? Am I insane? Is that a Texas thing? Was my school yellow? Was your school yellow? My school was made with rocks and trouble. Ooh, look at this little town. I wish I could put little people in there. Oh, well, I guess I live with nothing but birds. That sounds about right. Oh, that's what you do. You make a big, long, unnecessary walk to school. That's what you do. Wait, didn't I do that? Actually, yeah, I did. No, damn it. No, damn it. No, damn it. There we go. Beautiful. Perfect even. God, son of a freak. Is that a school? That's a school. That's a school. That's sword school right there. That's where you have to go. I make everyone go to sword school. Ring of the bell, noon o'clock. You know where to go. You leave town center here, walk past the witch tower, walk past the tenements, and the long and winding road to sword school. Everyone goes. Every day. Otherwise you get kicked off into the ocean. Actually, no, I just walk you past here. Be like, hey, welcome to my, um, welcome to my set. This is a uh, 460 foot long set that I run through every morning. And that's my whole show now. I just run back and forth. And then I'll just be like, yeah, cool, cool, yeah, that's great. And then push them off right here. You gotta push them off face down. You don't want somebody's eyeballs looking up at you after you push them off a crevice. Shit will leave, won't, won't leave you. They'll stay with you for the rest of your godforsaken life. Oh, neat! How did I do that? How do you even get there? That's the better question. Oh, you get it from here. And you walk out to your nice little patio! Oh, that's supreme neat! Oh, those bad North devs. <laughs> That's the last remaining This guy has to pay top slum. Okay, this guy has to pay top slum to dive off the side, then climb up the ladder to his pent room, his penthouse apartment all the way up on the top. And you take the little slide whistle down. Makes a little whoop sound as you go on down. Beautiful. Just perfect looking town. Nobody would ever say anything bad about this town. Otherwise, I'll walk you through my nice set and push you off the, uh, off the edge of oblivion. How do you get here? Do you fly in? Is there an airport? Do you swim here? Is this purgatory? This is purgatory. It doesn't look like there's any way to get here. There is. This is how you make a town. Man, just like you draw it up. Just like you draw it up. Beautiful. Well, that's really coming along nicely. These are just a regular, these regular people right here. Back of town. Everybody wakes up, comes on down to Cap's uh, morning meeting. Right here, right before sword school. We're right here. Just having a lovely Sunday lemonade afternoon here. In the land of... Scrimmus, scrimmus, scraw. Guy who lives here likes his eggs. Over easy. Would build a bench if I could. Can I build a bench? Probably not. No benches. No benches for you, scrim scraw. That's okay though. You don't need them. Eh, there's some in there. Wait, I'm guessing this guy. No, no, no. That's not his all property. You can't have. All... You can't have all that property. That's a lot of slum to be paying. And this is a cheap town for cheap people. Who just want the world to be aesthetically pleasing. Every witch, nerd, freak, goth, warrior. 
Hell, even the poets can come. Those cannibals. Except all that really happened is I'd be walking around completely by myself. Strap him to a window somewhere. And I'd live with the birds.